We just landed I'm here with my boy D Wit. We're here. So we, we had no idea we were gonna fly together. But we ended up flying up together. So it's gonna be cool. The flight was dope. Uh now to the next and we're ready. Perfect. Shout out to Steven putting me onto the hoodie. You Nico, you know the vibes. Um What's up y'all? Uh as you guys can see I'm in the hotel. Hotel's actually pretty nice. Very nice. Um, I just sorted out all my clothes. Everything's organized. You know me. Shoot. <laughs> um, but yeah, man. A uh, little rundown. You guys probably don't know why I'm here, but or where I'm at. I'm here in Detroit, Michigan. I'm here with Forever Jones. They uh, are the creators of He Wants It All. Today, hallelujah, and told a whole bunch of records that went global um, past years. And they were doing their thing. And then, you know, as time progressed, everybody just starts growing and doing their own thing. And life hits and, you know, it's natural. But what else is also natural is God in his wonders. Uh, we might not understand it, but because... He's sovereign. He's going to get the glory either way. You feel me? Um, whether you like it or not, he's going to get the glory. Um, so Forever Jones, they got a call for Triumph Church Triumph Church here uh, in Detroit. And I got the call by DeWitt. Uh, he is a faithful member at Trinity Church. Um in New York in the Bronx. Not the Bronx, in New York, sorry, Harlem. And yeah, you know, just kept it cool. I was just me and praise served I was just serving there. Like I would help out from time to time and you know, now I'm now here, you know. Look at God. I know, right? Uh I'm being mad cringy. But just to, just to close this out really quickly, um, this date is actually um, was actually literally the Lord. So uh, really quickly, I'm not gonna take no much time. I'm maybe gonna do this in a minute. There was a time I was going through a lot, and I'm pretty sure a lot of musicians can relate. I was going through a a kind of like a shutdown mode. I was like, oh man, I'm not where I want to be, you know, I'm just having like the doubts and the anxiety just trying to like overtaking you. Um, I was definitely going through that. And I was, it was just one day I was at the crib and I was like, man, I'm not worthy. Like I'm not, I'm whack, I'm trash. I'm just speaking lies and agreeing with what the enemy says to me, which is so stupid and dumb of me. But you know, sometimes it could get the best of us. And it definitely got me like in a in a in a in a hold for for a short period of time that day, and literally I was just like, man, like I don't know why people call me. I don't know why I do. I don't know why I'm doing this. I'm gonna just go get a regular. I'm gonna just let me start applying to this, that, and the third. Cut it short again. I just want to remind y'all that when God speaks a word, that He will be faithful to see it through all day every day he is not going to fail he won't he won't ever fail literally he just won't he's a man of his word and he's gonna keep his promises so literally that day um i was just in doubt a lot of fear and just anxiety and then like kid you not not even 30 minutes later i get a call like yo bro are you free this day in the dark I don't know if you know my family, Forever Jones. So I know I had no idea that he was Forever Jones. Like I had no idea that he was a part of the family. 
And I was like, Forever Jones. He was like, yeah, we sent, we we came up with He Wants It All. I was like, that's your family? What the heck? So it was just crazy. And I had, I literally had no idea. So he asked me if I was available. And I said, yes, like they need a drummer because shout out to uh, their son, Judah. I don't know if you're seeing this. Much love to you, bro. Um, we haven't met. Love to meet you one day. Uh... So he has, he's celebrating his anniversary. May the Lord continue to bless you guys. He's celebrating his one year wedding anniversary. And, you know, I'm just here fitting in and doing what I have to do. But I'm super grateful. And that moment, going back to the story, that moment, the Lord was literally like telling me, reminding me, like, trust in me. Don't fear. Like, I got you. Um, so another side note. <laughs> so every year, the Lord, I... Every new year, I ask God, I'm like, hey, Lord, um, what do you want me to focus on? Like, of course, we all have seasons in our life and everything. But I personally, as my relationship with the Father, I always ask him, Lord, what do you want me to focus on? What do you want me to hold on to? What do you want me to uh, marinate on or resonate on? And the word trust and do not fear was what the Lord told me in the beginning of this year. Um, and the more I do that, the more I see him at work, the more I see that he is true. Like, he's not going to let me, he's not going to leave me alone. He's, he's not going to let me fall down in the ditch. Um, and if I do fall down in the ditch because of my own doings, he's going to be right there to pick me up. So I've just been trusting him and he just reminded me with that, with this call. So it's not just a gig. I don't even like to say that. Um, it's really just the Lord showing off and me being able to do this to the fullest that I can. So that was that. I'm sorry. It was like six minutes. I did not want, intend that to be this long, but I'm being, um, my distraction is like, I'm trying to focus here and here. They're showing like the little replay of the playoffs of, uh, the 76ers and Miami Heat. Yo, who y'all got for the finals? I got the Warriors, baby. Come, come on, Curry. Ah! Yeah, but... Yeah, so that's that. Feel me? So I'm just chilling now in the room. I don't know what I'm... I'm just waiting for them to call me up. And then we're going to go for, like, a little soundtrack. A little rehearsal soundtrack. And then we'll be back. See you tomorrow. What up, y'all? It is day two, Saturday. Today is Saturday. Um, we had breakfast, watched some movie. My boy is hitting the gym. Yes, sir. Tell the time. Come on, Deeks. <laughs> hitting the gym. Oh, we just did a little run through of what's of how we're gonna play out the songs. Um, it was good. Felt really good. I know God's gonna get the glory. He's in the midst already. Um, yeah. My boy D Wit got a little story. My guy, <laughs> my guy last night was a little adventurous, right? His tire, one hundred percent. Not my tire, but the the tire blew out literally on the freeway, and we were stranded. But but God, but God, that's it. <laughs> Yo, I don't I don't think I told you, but I was this close to renting a, a, a Avis rental car. Yeah. To go and pick it up. Oh, bro. <laughs> Yo, this is oh, close. Because <laughs> I looked up. I looked. I swear to you. I can show you my history, bro. It said, <laughs> I looked up like car rent was near me. No, nah, bro. We were out of it. So, it literally was like, it was it was so chill. Like, we were just talking. And, oh, wow. And, like, we, we hear like a, and we hear, but we, nobody said anything. And, like, Howie was like, let me check. Just to see Dang. It. And that, that, that back. Back left tire was going out, bro. Crazy. But we made it here. We made it, Doc. We about to get ready. Lobby call is 2.30. Yes, sir. So we finna dress to impress. Just kidding. Just gonna dress. Up, y'all. I know we in the same 
we in the same literally place, but <laughs> trust me, we're not. We did we did our first service. How how was it, bro? Man, it was good. It was it was really beautiful. I gotta say, JD, you cold. Nah, you cold, nah. There's bro. I ain't seen that. Honestly, I need to stay. Fuck it. I'm not. I'm just trying to stay on fire. I forgot. I don't want to be cold. I was corny. <laughs> <laughs> that was wild corny. All right, day two, last day. Any words, bro? It's been a blast. It's been a blast. It's gonna be awesome. Yeah. God's gonna get the glory. Yeah, our hearts Three are. Services. Three services back to back. Nothing too. Nothing too hard for my God. So we're here at the church. Just wanna show y'all. Musician side, keys, drums. Uh, pretty nice church, Triumph Church. Super huge. Um, yeah, if I'm being honest, sometimes it's a little difficult to like communicate with the singers because they're so upfront and down on the lower level. But we pulled through yesterday, so I'm pretty sure today's gonna be better. So let's get it. Past few days were amazing. Two, two past. Oh, we landed Friday. We played Saturday, Sunday. Past few days were amazing. God got the glory. Flow was there. Flow was definitely there. We didn't have a rehearsal, but there was. We definitely picked up on each other, and the chemistry was very strong. So that's always good. It was. It was amazing. I love the Jones family. They're mad cool. It's fun, man. I'm really grateful. So our plane is right here. We board in about 10 minutes. So thank you for watching all the way through. And appreciate y'all, man. God bless you. Stay in Christ.